If there was ever a time in which Asta can actually prove himself, not a peasant, not useless, all that, it's not going to be during a meeting where they're giving out awards to the already congratulatory no nobles, royals, all the people who are higher ups. It's during a fight, three on three, and this one's called the one with no magic. I'm just saying, Asta, come on, bro. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius, back at it again with Black Clover, episode 37. I am so excited. We got three on three, Jack the Ripper, Charlotte, and Nozel versus Raya, Vito, and Fauna. That's just crazy right there, but shit's gonna go down. Like, shit is gonna go down, down. There's really no else other context besides that, just this 3v3 that's going on. And then we'll go from there. That's literally it. So without any further ado, guys, if you guys want full length and early access to this episode, all the other shows I'm watching, check out the Patreon down below. Always available for you guys. We are four episodes ahead on Patreon right now. If you guys are not subscribed, make sure to subscribe. Hit that bell button so you guys always know when I post. And then follow me on all my social medias, Twitch, Instagram, Twitter, all at Dapper Darius. Thank you guys so much. Let's hop into this. Black Clover, episode 37, the one with no magic. <laughs> I appreciate that. I like the resolve from Nish. Good. And like I said earlier, it didn't seem like he was necessarily hostile or had malicious intent. He was just was not in a good mental space, you know? And with Asa saying, let's be buddies, you know? Like, Asa's the one person everyone needs. He's not going to judge you. He's just going to be there for you, bro. He's like Naruto, bro. Asta's in quite the predicament right now. He's gonna need it. Yeah, we need you, buddy. We need you. I'm glad Rebecca saw this at least. Oh, come on. Don't say that. You're amazing, Rebecca. You really shouldn't, but neither of you are the one he gave his heart for. <laughs> Yeah, he's definitely crazy. <laughs> Charlotte's hilarious. <laughs> the ground won't let my ass go, and ground loves me too much. I love her, like, aquamarine colored fucking grimoire. It's, it's good to know Yami's pulling, pulling the a most amazing woman. Nozil is about to get some revenge for his country and for Fogolian. I knew Nazo would say that, and I agree for right now. I agree with that. You might hold him back, but in a little bit, when you can actually prove yourself, do it. Do it. Do it, Asta. So it seems like it's Veto, not Veto. Corpse hunting briar trees. Ooh, the dark katana. Death scythe. Ooh. And he's been calling them insects the whole time, so this is actually the best matchup. Don't underestimate insects. He's not wrong about that. Ooh, he wants to go after Lix. I don't think Fauna's gonna let that happen. Yep. As if those flames could hurt me. Who do you th I love that though. Shouts out to Fogolia, my boy. This is quite the battlefield in front of our other fucking our other peeps. Jesus Christ. 
He's over here judging him, watching him. Ah, uh, so he couldn't see because of this fucking all this dust and shit, but he can tell what's going on. I was gonna say, is Oster gonna stay? Because you could take the rest of them home. Oster could stay. Ooh, I love seeing their grimoires too. Ooh, this animation is snapping. Yes, give me more info, please. No! Motherfucker has to do something with summoning the. Oh. I thought they were going home. Oh. The one with no magic! No one would expect Master to be there! With the key, with the key. With the key! Oh, I wish his sword were sharper. He could literally chop his head off right now. Because he has no magic. That's such a plug. So amazing. Oh, he knows it's not sharp, so we gotta go for the body shot. But then we go to Oriyami with the... Ah! That was quite the fucking hit. I love that motto to me. It reminds me so much of My Hero Academia. Go beyond plus ultra. Go beyond your limits. Surpass them. I love it. <laughs> if only Seke could see this, his captain fighting alongside Asta. That would be insane, you know? <laughs> The ceiling magic? Because he has anti- A demon dweller sword. Oh! A master? This crappy Grimoire. He doesn't know the full fucking power of those things. Alright, you said that already, but who is your master? Tell me who! Yeah, I'm saying. They sealed in his power. So, in or okay, so it don't no, it not only saves our characters from this devastating blow, but it, to save Lit himself because this is like a self-destructing explosion type thing. They're gonna seal him in, which Oss is the one who broke the seal with his magic sword. So they have to do Trinity sealing, which you got to think about it. Three people this strong together have to seal him. They got Valtos because of his fucking speed of light magic. And they were able to use his cot. So that's how they originally came in. We had Raya use his copy magic on Valtos for the spatial. Okay. That copy magic is fucking clutch. I wouldn't say easily. They had to work together, the three of them. And they definitely weren't. These guys are amazingly strong. Yes. Good. Good. I still like that, you know? He's still a prick and a dick, but he's a prick with morals and justice, you know? I'll take it. They did say they lost. It's a good question, Jack. That's a typical Yami answer. I like that. <laughs> I 
Hey, Charlotte, I don't blame you. If I was in this world, I'd fall for Yami, goddammit. <laughs> Yami is a pimp, bro. <laughs> Oh, it's funny, me and him yawn at the same exact time. What the hell? <laughs> Alright, next up, we got Raya coming in to save Giorg and Catherine. Ooh! Damn, that was a good-ass episode. Another fantastic episode. I love seeing the fights. I love seeing the Briar from Charlotte. I love seeing Mercury magic from Nozzle. The severing magic is cool from uh, Jack. It makes sense. He's a praying mantis. And I love how um, Veto kept calling him insects the whole time. And he's like, don't don't underestimate an insect. What the, 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 the? You know, you really shouldn't in real life. Like, I fucking hate insects. Those, fucking, those guys are crazy. And it's like, can you imagine if an ant was the size of a human? Because ants can lift, what, five, ten times their weight? Imagine if we... Me as a 200 pound male could lift five to a thousand pounds. Oh my god, 500 to a thousand. That'd be just insane. And insects are just crazy, they're built different, literally. But we were able to get him back. So, licked everyone's chilling, they're relaxing, they're healing back up. But we have to go save Georg and Catherine. Looks like Raya is gonna do that, which is just scary. But the biggest things I would say are the grimoire that Asta has are his masters that he was talking about summoning like 20 episodes ago. They're his grimoire and his swords. The I'm pretty sure I got it right, but the Demon Slayer sword and the Demon Sweller. Is that what it said? Let me see if I can go back and catch that right now. Yep. No, I said Sweller. Demon Dweller. I'm an idiot. See, that's just I was so into it. Oh, so in, you know, the, the middle of that, but, but the demon, so it dwells, so something dwells, like, that would make sense, because it's like, a, I don't fucking know, Demon Slayer, oh, I'm, I want to know so much, bro, I, I'm just so curious, and uh, is there going to be more swords, are we going to have a whole collection, are we only having the two, I'm, I want to know more, I want to know more, whoo, okay, ah, man, I just want to get this next episode, alright guys, I'm going to end it, that was a fantastic episode, like I said, I can't wait to hop this next one, thank you so much for, enjoying if you did please leave a like let me know your thoughts down below as always if you guys want to rewatch this one on the full length and or watch the next ones early access full length all that jazz check out that patreon down below always always there for you guys um, i'll see you guys in this next one peace out dapper squad you guys are amazing